for more than 30 years that uh, in CIBS existence, the concerns with accessibility for people with disabilities and also visual impaired, it's in CIBS ADN. Uh, so, and this is reflected on the ATM's physical requirements and also on POS physical requirements. For instance, the heights of the devices have to be measured uh, into a particular distance in order for people in a wheelchair to be able to access all the devices in a comfortable way. For people with visual impaired uh, disabilities, for instance, there exist labels with braille inscriptions that makes it easier to identify the devices on the, on the ATM. The customer keyboard, for instance, has a razor dot that identifies key number five, which makes it easier to locate the remaining keys. Cancel keys, continue keys, and also the correction keys has also razor information that makes it easier to recognize this type of keys. When a card is inserted, for instance, the ATM uses sensors to detect the correct position of the card, making it easier for people with visual impaired disabilities to recognize the correct position of the card when it is inserted. The razor dot makes a uh, particular importance because it is possible pressing this key to switch the ATM into a high contrast mode, make it easier for people with visual disabilities to recognize the inscriptions. Also, the audio makes a particular uh, important role because it guides people to perform the operations. CIBS has major concerns with accessibility, so uh, therefore we are always looking for improvements uh, to make the access to these services more easier to everybody. Mm -hmm.